In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the bus stop method for division. The first thing we need to do is draw our bus stop. And the number that we're dividing goes inside the bus stop. The number that we um, are dividing it by, that goes outside the bus stop. Now, all we do is we look at our number and we go across and see how many times does this fit in to these numbers. Now, I know that three fits into four once, so I put my number one there. I have one left over, so I carry that one and I place that there. The reason we do this is so we can then go, how many threes go into this number that we've just created, which is 12? So that one that we carried goes there and it goes in front to make a new number, so 12. How many threes go into 12? If you know your three times table, it's three, six, nine, 12, it's four times. And finally then, how many threes go into nine? And again, we know that that is three. So our answer is 143. Okay, for my second example, uh, we're gonna be doing a slightly trickier one. So again, we draw the bus stop. The number that we're dividing goes inside. And the number that we're dividing by goes outside. So again, this time we go across and we say, how many eights go into six? Well, this time the answer is zero because eight can't fit into six. So what we do in this case is we look again, we say, well, how many eights go into, and we look across this number here. So this is now our number, 64. How many eights go into 64? And if you know your eight times table, there are eight eights in 64. And finally, we go, how many eights are in eight? Uh, that's one. So our answer is 81. Another example, we draw a bus stop method, four, eight, seven, eight, and we're dividing by nine. So again, we follow the step. How many nines go into four? Well, they don't, so we'll move across. How many nines go into 48? So if you use your times tables, it'll tell us that there are five nines that fit in, because five nines are 45. We can't fit any more in there, so we'll put five up there for now. Now what we do now is we look at the difference. So nine fives make 45, but we've got 48 spaces available. So we write the difference in here, we carry that over. The difference was three. So there's 45 spaces, uh, but 48 altogether. So we squeeze that extra digit in there that we carry over. Now, how many nines go into 37? Um, again, that's we use our times tables. It will tell us that there's four nines that just fit in there because four nines are 36. And the number that we've got left is 1, 36 and 37, the difference is 1, carry that over. How many 9's going to 18? That's exactly 2, so the answer is 542.